come here with another um, looks book for you and this is the shimmering future one so this is from Starlux. Starlux has a monthly subscription they have the looks books and they have another version but I'm going to talk about the looks books so this is my third one I believe it's the third one or fourth one and um, they always come with three separate items I want to go ahead and show you what they came inside oh these are the gift cards that it came with I'll talk about that in one second but this is the looks book so it comes this one comes with an eyeshadow duo and it's called fortune 500 the golden ticket which is a golden liner and then we have this lip um, crayon and this is in the color opulence which is a very dark 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 plummy kind of wine colored and it always it always comes with this little pamphlet kind of thing here to kind of give you an idea of how to use these colors um, they did a really good job at kind of featuring the colors and the shades that they have in here now um, for me personally these uh, this um, trio right here is not my favorite set that I've gotten from um, the star looks uh, I can see how this could help and kind of go with the holiday kind of theme however it's not for everybody and I I don't tend to gravitate to very bold bold looks that's just not my style I did go ahead and try it out so it does always come with three cards in this particular one you don't get to choose the cards that you're going to be getting so um, this one here it has five dollars towards the star looks boutique this one is ten dollars towards the eyes collection um, and that's pretty good and then we have five dollars towards your first past looks book so I don't know I think I've gotten all of them so for me going back I wouldn't be you know I'd be getting a duplicate but I'm definitely gonna go and check it out now I have used the previous gift cards in the past to buy eyeshadows lipsticks eyeliners I believe so I have used the cards that do come in handy and it's a really nice discount um, and a couple other things I've gotten for free with um, the with the gift card alright so particularly the shadows they're very very pretty however they have so much fallout all over the place you have to be really careful I would definitely suggest putting a tissue under the eyes when you're applying them because they're gonna make a mess everywhere I also would suggest using them while they're wet because when they're dry they just crumble all over the place um, they do they are very very pretty but again you can see that they're very very crumbly there is a ton of glitter in here and it just uh, just like it sprinkles all over your face when you're using it so that's why I would definitely suggest using it while it's wet so I have tried using this a couple of times um, the first time I was using a brush with it I tried it dry it didn't fare very well and then I tried it wet um, and it was much much better however again it still had tons and tons of fallout I would suggest kind of spraying it and then using your fingers to apply it that to me is the best way and that's how I actually have used it for today um, I used it with um, having my fingertips a little bit damp and then spraying with a little bit of rose water on the top and then using my fingertips to kind of press it in versus using a brush and swiping it or pressing it in because it just kind of crumbled and fell all over the place so I, I feel like when you're going to apply this one if you use your fingertips you're gonna have better results and not such a mess but I would definitely suggest you putting a tissue underneath your eye regardless um, when you're going to apply it so they are pretty shades they're just a mess to deal with now the eyeliner on the other hand um, this is something that I personally would not gravitate to just in general um, it was fun to try it out and fun to use um, but I just don't see myself using a gold liner in everyday use or anything like that so the liner applies really beautifully I wish I had gotten a black in this to be honest with you or even a purple or some other color besides gold because I don't feel like gold is something that I would use on a day-to-day -day basis maybe another darker color a plum color or something I could possibly get away with that but the liner applied beautifully I can I mean it just it was really really pretty really easy and it stayed put it's not going anywhere once it dries where it's at it is what it is it's not going anywhere it's not gonna move around on you 
and you'll have that sharp line for the whole day. I mean, if you're going to be rubbing, rubbing your eyes, of course, it's, you know, it's going to rub off if you rub hard enough. But in general, this liner, it stays, when I used it, it stayed the whole entire day. The lip color, wow. This, if you like dark, dark, bold lips, you're going to love this. For me personally, this is the darkest color. I just, I don't even know how to explain the color. It's pretty, but for me, I feel like it was just too, too dark. And that's the reason why I don't have it on right now because it was just very dark. But I'll go ahead and show you what it looked like when I was applying it earlier um, and another time. Um, this is just like the darkest burgundy plum color. I just, I don't know how to describe it. It is so, so dark. So all in all, what do I think? Again, this month is just not my favorite one. It's not one that I tend to gravitate to, but in past boxes, they all have um, bolder colors, more fun colors. They can, in, it, it definitely introduced you into something completely different that maybe is out of um, your comfort zone or something like that. I did try it, I, I used it, and um, it's just a combination of colors for me personally that is just not my cup of tea. However, you can see the pictures here. They did a beautiful job. It looks lovely. Um, mixing the lip color in with something else um, is probably the best route to go, in my opinion, for myself, not for you. If you like dark colors, that's probably perfect for you. Um, it's just a personal preference. So that's it for this month's Star Looks Looks book. Um, thank you guys so very much. Let me know what you think about um, the color combinations that they had sent over this month. Um, if you got this, what are your opinions on it? Um, and that's it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you again in another video. Bye.